So, welcome back. So, this video is going to be on the new upcoming fresh TBC server called Sun Fury. Right now, it is in a beta state with the full launch expected in October 20th. Now, there are changes to this server. It is not completely Blizz like. And I have a video that just came out before this one, which would go over all of the, as of right now, announced changes with. More details to come in the future, and I will make a video on that when it eventually gets, you know, detailed out to us. So, in the meantime, I'm just going to make a short video hopping in to their beta and seeing what it has to offer. Now, I've already logged onto this character just for a second, just to make sure it worked and everything. And this is not a full-on go check out everything beta. This is a condensed beta where you are um, put into a test area with it looks like there's vendors everywhere and probably level boosters just to check out the mechanics behind the server itself so i do not expect this to be long at all we're just going to check it out and see how it feels all right so gotta go ahead and enter world now if you are interested in checking out Oh my god, the beta or the server itself, I have the link to their Discord server in my Discord server. You can click that on the link in the description below, and the channel that says uh, private server channels, you can go there and find all of the various private servers that I follow. Okay, so we are now in, you can see it is called the Endless Testing Area. There's uh, vendors over there that look like the uh, Gruul's Lair bosses, there's a mailbox... Uh, a barber shop. Ooh, okay, so we have barber shop in the game. That was not listed before. Let's see. Ah, so we have all of the uh, Wrath of the Lich King ones, because I know for a fact that one right there is not a default vanilla horn style. Uh, neither is that one or that one. Oh, wow. Double broke. No, never mind. Oh, yeah, I, I use this one in um, retail on my, on my torn. He's got that one. So yeah, uh, there's going to be a lot of new hairstyles for your characters here. I wonder... No, it doesn't look like they added uh, Grim Totem. That, that would have been cool if they added that. Look like it's free, so we can just go ahead and uh, change up my character here. Make him look a little different. Okay. Oh, wait, I don't want that horn style. That horn style is fucking ugly as hell. Uh, give me that one. Yeah, that's cool. All right. Arena set, PvE set, wish to learn professions. All right, cool. So we're gonna go ahead and oh, only Beastmaster is available. All right, so give me Beastmaster. Nice. Oh wow, they gave me the freaking uh, blindfold. Uh, let's see. I need gold. What did they give me? Holy shit, fifty thousand gold. Oh, we got bags too. Oh, what do we what do we get? Gray Kodo. We have Swift Yellow Wind Rider. Sweet. Go away. Uh, what is this? A dagger? I don't know what. Ah, because it meant to put it on us, and, um, it didn't get rid of the, uh, thing. Oh, wow, I forgot about these daggers. That looks fucking cool. <laughs> it's been a while. I completely forgot those existed. Okay, now that I have all of my, um, abilities set, let's see what else we got. Let's see, we got Arena Organizer, we got Battle Master... Oop, I missed this guy here. 3vc solo match. Uh, that's for um, just items to use. Oh my god, go away. We have... Ooh. Swiftness potion, invisibility potion, elixir of demons, demon slaying, gift of Arthas, dragon breath chili. Oh man, I love that. I'm gonna... Go away! Oh my god, these freaking tutorials, they still haven't gone away. Alright, let's check out what these guys have over here. We're gonna... Weapons Vendor. I wonder if I could get the, um... Cataclysm's Edge, I remember that. Ah uh, yeah, I remember a lot of role players had that gun. That gun, and there was another one that, uh, people had that freaking everyone one there look at that give me a dragon hawk oh sweet 
It just instantly gives you one. Okay, there's talents. Uh, oh, we got pet talents. All right, so we do have pet talents. Okay, okay. So secondary talents is your dual spec. You can activate these talents and then put your unspent talent points in there. And then that is your third one, which you have to purchase from the store, as it mentioned before uh, below. There's the pet talents, but where is the uh, mounts? Because I clicked on them and and it taught them to me. But I'm not seeing the tab anywhere. Character, skills, reputation, pets. Ah, there it is, mount. Okay, so let's grab the wyvern. I cannot use that here. Nice. Okay, let's use the gray kodo. Now, I wonder how far I can go. Because right now we're just on the um, Throne of the Elements area. I wonder how far it will let me leave. Oh, I've hit the invisible wall. So that is as far as you can go on the beta. Actually, no, it looks like I can go farther. So why could... Ah, okay, there it is. Yep, so that's as far as you can go, is just the uh, Throne of the Elements. Okay, guys, I figured it out. E uh, you access the, ra uh, the dungeons and raids through the uh, dungeon finder. That's why I wasn't able to um, find a person over here. That's because it's all right over here. Now, I'm not saying anything for raids, so there is no looking for raid finder. It is just dungeons. So, um, I picked normal dungeon. I really should have picked... Uh, here, let's leave Q real quick. I should try to pick a uh, heroic dungeon. Maybe more people are queued up into that. Uh, let's see. Assembling group, I'm going to see if it'll tell me a estimated wait time. There's not that many people online right now, so I don't think anyone is going to be... There's 12 people online, and there's several waiting around. Actually, everyone's waiting around. And there are people actually out in the world leveling. Now, the experience rate for this server is going to be times 5, so maybe I should make a low-level character and check out to see how fast that really is. Um, yeah, I'm not really getting a, a group right now, no one's really queuing up, so I'm going to go ahead and check out that leveling. Alright, I've been sent to the Torin starting zone. I am level 1, so this is how we should be starting off. Now, I'm just going to level from 1 to 5, just to see how fast I'm actually leveling. I'm not going to go beyond that, I just want to get a feel for the experience rate gain. Something I like about the 3.3.5 client is that the hunter character will automatically go from gun to or ranged to melee, depending on how close uh, the enemy is, which is always a great uh, quality of life. Something that I do not like about the um, oh my god, go the fuck away. Something I don't like about uh, just the normal 1.12 client is because it does not support that. I believe this change was in TBC, but I know for a fact Wrath definitely does have it. So, oh wow. So I've only killed two birds, and I've already leveled to level two. And typically it takes about a few more kills than that. So definitely, off the bat, I am feeling that the leveling is going to be a lot faster. Uh, I'm going to see how fast I can get to level five just doing normal leveling. I have no... Bonuses, no gear, no, not even a pet. I've already killed, um, that was my third bird, and I'm already halfway into <laughs> level two. So, I'll meet you on the other side, see how far I get. Boom, okay, I've leveled. Also, um, something that I did mention in my video talking about what's going to be available on the server is that you are going to be automatically learning spells and abilities. So... Upon leveling up, I noticed that for some reason I have throw, I don't know why, but I have learned track beasts. So now I can track beasts in the world without having to visit the trainer. Alright, so... <laughs> 
all I did was do the first two quests, which was to get the seven uh, plane striders and to go get the water from the well. And I'm already level five. So, <laughs> so I've only done like a third of the starting zone and I'm already I've already out leveled it. So that's pretty much giving you an idea of how the leveling is going to be, which um. <laughs> I mean, I'm, I'm going to be okay with it because if this is a TBC server, I don't have to do all of vanilla all over again. So blazing through it just to get to the actual TBC stuff, that's completely fine. Uh, getting to TBC itself, it really depends on the player at that point. If you want to enjoy the leveling experience that TBC has to offer, or if you want to just get straight into the dungeons and raids. Again, there are a lot of different types of players that are out there that do that different stuff. Um... There are Blizz like servers out there that will offer that experience to you if you want to just level up and do everything normally. Uh, whether they're populated or not, that's the issue. We all saw what happened with Felmist, and even then they had a um, increased leveling rate, though I heard that he removed that. I I'm not quite sure what happened there. But um, either way, that's giving you just a little taste of what's to come in the uh, Sun Fury server. Again, the launch of this server is going to be October 20th, so just under a month away. Again, I have also another video that came up before this that will go through all of the details that have been told so far of what to expect, even though I talked about some of it in the video that I'm doing right now. So, I will be covering this video uh, for a little bit longer. I do plan on trying out this server just again to reminisce in the nostalgia of playing TBC back in the day and checking it out. I do not feel like I will um, be staying on the server for the reason that I just don't care about TBC. It's I, out of the three expansions, three main expanses, it's my least favorite, so, and it's not anything wrong with the expansion itself, there are a lot of good things about this, the expansion, I just personally don't like it, mostly from an aesthetic point of view, I don't care about out of world alien stuff, that's not my thing, anyway, so, um, that is the end of this video. I will see you guys next time. Be sure to like and subscribe if you want to see more Sun Fury or other private server coverage and playthroughs and all that fun stuff. Bye-bye.